<laughs> so we're hoping tomorrow we get a pro card. All right, guys, we're about to head out and take the lie detector, the polygraph. All right, guys, we made it to the polygraph location. This is the host hotel behind me. We just finished with the lie detector, and oh my gosh, I was so nervous in there. Like, my heart is still racing, bro. I don't know why. We are back for our spray tan. We're getting three coats. Uh, we're back for our three coats. Actually, at her drive because we're a little tipsy. We had a look at the tan in this natural lighting. It's actually insane. It makes my eye color pop. Makes my teeth pop. Men's bodybuilding. Men's oh, bodybuilding. So we're gonna all right, we made it to the show. I got about an hour until we get on stage. Good morning guys and welcome back to another video. We got a very exciting weekend um, tomorrow. It's actually Friday today. Tomorrow is Saturday the 27th, Memorial Day weekend. And we got our first ever men's physique competition. Um, yeah, let me get a little coffee, wake up a little bit. I literally just woke up. It's like 6.30 a.m. Um, but the day starts today. The day starts on Friday. I know show day is not till tomorrow, but I got a lot of things going on today that's included with the show. So I figured I would uh, take you guys along with me. Uh, first things first, we're going to do fasted cardio here in just a little bit. Um, but no set cardio today, like we're not going on a 30, 45 minute jog. Today is just 10,000 steps throughout the day. And at 11 a.m., which is in about four and a half hours, I got my polygraph, which is a lie detector test I must go take and must go pass in order to compete, in order to step on stage. This is NAMBF, it is North American Natural Bodybuilding Federation. The lie detector slash polygraph is for a reason to prove that you are a natural status. You have been a natural athlete, a natural competitor uh, for your entire life. You know, you don't use any PEDs, nothing like that to enhance you, to make your physique better than others. Um, everyone's on the same playing field in this division, which is what I like about it. So yeah, I wanted to compete naturally. Uh, that's what we're doing tomorrow. We are signed up for novice which is um, anyone can compete in there as long as they haven't won a show um, and first timers of course too with not much experience so I'm going to be competing in novice and then open pro qualifier which is open to anyone regardless of age and experience. I started filling out um, adding and increasing more carbs to each meal about three days ago this week so uh, that's obviously taking effect that's working um, today we're pulling back carbs a little bit increasing fats um, just kind of to flush out the extra water. Um, we're gonna manipulate water later too. We're gonna reduce the amount of waters we're, we're drinking. Normally I am at two gallons per day. Um, it's gonna go to roughly a gallon and a gallon and a half, if that today, 
My hair is a mess. You can tell I just woke up. Um, crazy. I can't put on deodorant or cologne today. So I'm going to be smelling like a bum because, uh, yeah, apparently for the tanning session, it'll turn me green if I have it on or if I put it on at all today. So we're hoping tomorrow we get a pro card because the Open Pro, the winner of that, receives a pro card. And if I can say that I've got, you know, my first natural show, I got a pro card, like, dude, that'd be so sick. That's like the goal right there, to become a natural pro first shot. You know, we're hoping for the best. We're not expecting anything, um, but we're hoping for some good results. I need to wake up, <laughs> get some calories in me. You guys are probably like, what am I watching right now? He's all over the place. He doesn't know what to say, this and that. If you guys know, if you guys ever gone through prep, your brain does not function properly, okay? Especially after not a lot of sleep, no caffeine, no calories. The brain does not function how it should, okay? I'm pretty slow, um, but we're gonna get the day started. Things will pick up, things will ramp up. So stay tuned, stay with me. Uh, we got some exciting things coming. All right, guys, we're about to head out and take the lie detector, the polygraph. I don't know why my nerves are acting up right now, but like hopefully it doesn't raise a red flag. <laughs> high blood pressure, high heart rate. I don't know, I've just, I've never done something like this before. Never took a lie detector for any reason. Um, yeah, I don't know, I'm just, just kind of feels a little weird, but hey, we're gonna go in there, we're gonna pass that, um, and then the next step after that, of course, throughout the day we're gonna eat our meals, and then we got three coats of tanning, like I said. Alright guys, we made it to the Polygraph location. This is the host hotel behind me. Um, people coming in from different states are gonna stay here because, uh, the show, the auditorium, is just a seven minute drive from here, making it nice and convenient. Uh, I was gonna stay here overnight, but it just added, it was gonna add a lot of unnecessary stress for me. You know, bringing a bunch of meals, meal prepping, and given the rooms only have a microwave and a refrigerator, I figured it'd be best if I just made the commute like three, four separate times, back and forth, back and forth. Uh, I'm about an hour away from here, so I decided it'd be easier to get all my meals cooked at home, eat all my meals then, um, in between, and then head out to the show from my place. I don't think I'm gonna take you guys in with me, um, I'll show you guys in there later when I come back for my tanning appointment. Um, but right now, we're just going to go do the lie detector. I'm about 20 minutes early, I believe. Yep, 20 minutes exactly. Uh, I always remember the phrase, early is on time, on time is late, and late is forgotten. So it never hurts to be early. We just finished with the lie detector, and oh my gosh, I was so nervous in there. Like, my heart is still racing, bro. I don't know why. I answered everything truthfully, honestly, and like I was just nervous, man. My heart was racing like crazy. I never been in a setting like that. I didn't know what to expect. I had two tubes hooked up on my chest and my stomach, a couple things on my fingertips, uh, this blood pressure thing around my arm, like hooked up on all this stuff, man. I was just tweaking, Loki. I was tweaking in there. But good news is we passed. We are on the stage two, which is tanning tonight. I will be back here, show you guys the inside, what that looks like. Um, hopefully, get you guys in to see me getting my spray tan, my coats. I think I got three coats coming tonight. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get really dark in the next few hours. And I shaved last night, I got some baby butt skin. It feels like baby smooth. You guys ever put baby powder on a baby's butt? I sure haven't, but I could imagine it is silky smooth. And that's how my skin is feeling all over, whole entire body. So we're ready for the, for the tan. Um, and like I said earlier, you can't wear any deodorant, any cologne until after the show because it'll turn your skin green when we put the spray tan coats on. So there's a no-no there. I might be smelling a little gross throughout the day today and tomorrow, but shh, don't get too close to me, all right? We are back for our spray tan. We're getting three coats. I actually have my girl Mel holding the camera. You can show yourself if you want. I don't know how to <laughs> You just flip the camera around. That's all right. That's all right. Uh, we're back for our three coats. I actually had her drive because a little tipsy. We had uh, like four shots of vodka before we came. Um, recommended by coach, so don't be like, dude, why are you doing that? You don't know what you're doing. He knows what he's doing. It actually is proven to dry you out and like dehydrate you. I got a little extra water away from all the carbs I've been eating this last week. Um, so our goal with the vodka is just kind of to dry me out, bring out the veins, the vascularity, and kind of get rid of that extra water weight. So we're gonna start heading inside. I'm hoping that we can bring you guys in to the spray tan appointment. Although I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to because people are gonna be in their underwear and their boxers. So if no one's in there, I mean, shit, let's get it. But if there's other people, it'll probably be like a violation of privacy. So we're probably not gonna be able to bring you in. But we'll take you inside, check it out and see what we can do. Yeah. 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 
Everyone is, everyone who's green is the best, everyone who's yellow is secure and waiting. Oh yeah. There's absolutely no way we're gonna be able to bring you guys in there. You can show a little sneak peek in the yeah. room, but there's like, I don't even know if Mel will be able to go in there. I hope she will. There's like individual tents that everyone goes in. Plastic tents with towels wrapped around that they spray you in. So like, you're totally secluded, you're alone in there. Um, we'll try to get you a sneak peek of what it looks like, but unfortunately we're not actually going to be able to bring you in. So, uh, we'll be after that there. Are you going to see me after? This is before. Oh, um, no, look, we got some decent color, I'm not going to lie, a little bit. Look at the color. The after is crazy. <laughs> so while I was in there, um, there was a lady that was spray tanning me, and she said she thinks I'm going to do really well, so I'm super amped about that. Um, and the second thing she said was that you're going to piss people off. <laughs> I was like, why am I going to piss them off? She's like, because you have the darkest, best look I've seen. And she's like, are you Italian? I'm like, no, I'm white Native American. This and that. Um, so yeah, apparently we look really good. I got an advantage, I guess, going on stage. I'm super dark. It's really said the darkest she has done. Yeah, it's pretty late, huh? Like 930 or something? It's already 943. It took us like an hour and a half. <laughs> So we're gonna hit the road, catch some Z's. We're done eating, done drinking for tonight. Uh, and I'll catch you guys for the big show day tomorrow. Look at the tan in this natural lighting. It's actually insane. It makes my eye color pop, makes my teeth pop. It's actually wild. Like I might have to get a permanent one of these if those even exist. <laughs> um, ignore this. Someone must have drooled on me last night or something in my sleep. It definitely wasn't me, but uh, uh, that's why we got touch-ups backstage. Hopefully they can uh, fix that for me. And I got a little water under my nose. It feels like prep was so long, yet so quick. It's so weird. Like when you're in prep, personally, it's like, man, you're going through hell. It's taking forever. But now that we're here, we're at show day. The time has come. It feels like it flew by. We just got a meal down. We had 200 grams of jasmine rice. We're carving up, filling out. Um, I had four ounces of 96.4 lean ground beef, I had a gram of salt, and 16 ounces of water. And then meal two I'm going to have before I head out, that's going to be another 200 grams of jasmine rice, four ounces of chicken, another gram of salt, 16 ounces of water, and two ounces of vodka. Our next category, which is men's bodybuilding, men's oh, bodybuilding. bodybuilding. So we're gonna All right, we made it to the show. Right um, I got about an hour until we get on stage, and yeah, we're going to have to do some touch-ups beforehand, but the backstage is literally just a high school hallway. It's nothing sweet like I thought it would be, um, so I don't even got to show you that. It's literally a hallway. But yeah, I'm just sitting watching uh, the competitors up until we go, and then uh, I'll hand the camera off to someone else and we'll get this all on footage. Competitor number 116. 
Guys, we just finished our show and we won. We won. We took first. The craziest, most biggest, insane, loving support system. I have like 15, 20 people here. They all left. We're going to meet up at Jams. We're going to cook out, eat some good food, swim in the pool, drink some good liquor, celebrate this win. This is the NAMBF IPE Pro Card Medal. I get my official pro card in the mail within a week or two. At 2023 Mr. Natural Minnesota Men's Physique Open Overall Champion. We got Men's Physique Open Tall first place. And then we also got Mr. Natural Minnesota Men's Physique Novice Overall and Novice Tall first place. Guys, so everything I competed in, I won, I took first. I did not think it was gonna happen. I, I'm literally speechless, man. I can't even put words together. I'm so fucking thankful and so proud and so happy to be here today. And thankful for all you guys supporting me and sticking by my side and riding through it with me all. Shout out to my coach Alex, put me through this, helped me get all these trophies and medals in the first place. If you guys saw my Instagram story the other day, I was like, I saw some big monstrosus of a human <laughs> filling up his oversized tee. And you know, he was shorter than me. We ended up competing for open, me and him, and I somehow I won it. And I'm so fucking happy. Nelson, I was going to, I, I had no 
doubt in my mind he's gonna take it home, but we did it and I'm so happy. This is everyone that came to the show, like I said, crazy support system. This is all family right here. I love each and every one of these individuals. We are about to celebrate. I just had my first cheat was a small blizzard from Dairy Queen Royal New York Cheesecake. Oh my God, that was amazing. And then, you know me, got a full bag of Takis. Six crumble cookies. They got a new banana bread flavor, so I'm super pumped about that. Got some 1800 and some other drinks over here. So we're about to have a good night. Got the pool over here. Uh, fire pits over this way. Yo, check this out. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? This, this is the banana bread one I was talking about. I gotta, I gotta take a bite into this. Just try it out. Bro. <laughs> I want to know. <laughs> you don't even know. You will know though. I'll give you a bite. Try that. Get, get well in there. Bussin? Strawberry cake. Yeah. I'm That's saying. my birthday ritual. Me, 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 me. Warm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I am. Bussin. To wash it down. <laughs> get a little bing bong. <laughs> bing bong. <laughs> get a little bing bong. Kids, don't do this at home. Only stupid people do this. And we got another Noah favorite. Oh, yeah. Takis. Yeah. 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 This is my coach right here, he's six feet so. So he's looking at all us like, fuck you guys. Yeah. But now he's dialed in, he's ready. He said he wants to go to national, so it's easy for him to stay strict. His head's in the right spot, so no worries. Baby. No question, baby. No question, baby. Yes, I love all of you guys. Yeah, you guys are all fucking Yo, I gotta say one thing real quick, bro. Okay. I seen... Hey, hold up, hold up. Turn the music off. Turn the music off. Those same things guys should not real quick. Bro, chill out. Um, nah, I seen this dude's workouts through prep and how focused he was on meal prep and just getting everything squared away for the show. And bro, dedication feeds off, bro. Look at this family we're blessed enough to have, so it's a big deal. Bro. Congratulations. Bro. Hey, 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 let Lauren talk. Let the let the lady talk. I met most of you guys at the gym at no, I met like damn near all of y'all at the gym last summer. And that was so fucking lit. No, I have to say something. I was I was going through like, I don't know, I was just bored last night and I was watching my old YouTube vlogs. And I literally like my second YouTube video I've ever posted. There's a clip where I literally met you for the first time. Really? I was up, like, I follow you on Instagram, and then now we're here. Noah fucking won three fucking times oh, today. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, Lauren, fuck you. Yeah, fuck yeah, you. Fair. My bad. Yeah. Four times. Noah won four times today, and we have, like, a fucking amazing family here. Yeah. I literally love all of you so much. I'm so glad that we can all, like, hang out and share the same interests. I love you. Yeah. 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 To add on to that piece, I didn't want to met any of these dudes if it wasn't for the gym. Not sure. one single person here if it wasn't Literally. for the gym. Besides this man, I want to do with him. Yeah. Other than that, everyone I met at the gym, like it can fucking change your life. It's your circle, the people you hang around. Like the gym, just such a great thing. And uh, I said this at the show, but I want to thank each and every one of you that made it out there and supported. Got but hey, if you voices. didn't go, fuck you. Now, they had work. <laughs> <laughs> but no, the most, the most insane support system, I couldn't be more thankful and more blessed for all you guys that showed up. an amazing day, a fucking awesome summer, yeah. and a great life. Yeah. 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 Real. And we're getting roller coasters tomorrow. Hey, that's love. <laughs> this is my other brother. Hey. Oh damn, Carson! Oh, it's a vibe right here. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, spied it with his hand. That boy's a demon. <laughs> that boy's a demon. Yo, Mr. Payne. Everyone, 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 everyone. Yeah. Looking up.
can take what care of it. Mog everyone over here. Holy yeah. shit. Lauren Mog everyone over here. Yeah. <laughs> no one literally inspired me to go. Hey, step on it. Hey, step on it. Get up here. Minnesota. Give me the camera. Come on. Oh shit. Face on the camera. Yummy. Yummy. Smash. Bro, I'm saying I've got not the time for the last time. eight hours, man. I've been, I've been eating good after my show, man. I'm just enjoying myself, man. So, as long as the fam good, we good. What do they say? Uh, we didn't hear you. This is a toast to Noah yeah. uh -huh. winning the fucking competition. Yeah, man. Hey. Oh, <laughs> you said you were done. My boy, my four boy. Piece, four piece. <laughs> like a drip in there. Yeah. <laughs>